guys, I'm Noah from Tata Soul and today I want to show you the new Air Balloon Embroidery Kit. It's a very good kit for beginners because you only need one stitch to finish this, this project, which is the back stitch and I'm going to show you in a moment. If you order this kit, the uh, fabric comes already pre-painted, which is really cool. And my mom actually helped me with this project so you're going to see her stitching and me talking um, so let's get started first you're going to prepare your thread cut about 30 centimeters which is about 12 inches from one side insert your needle and from the other side tie a few knots I'm going to teach you how to do a back stitch it's a very easy stitch for beginners and you could do lots of embroidery um, patterns with it. It's very good for outlining and also for um, doing letters. So we are going to start by doing just a regular stitch, about half an inch. So you take your needle up and then go half an inch forward and take your needle back down. This is the first stitch. From now on you're going to do the stitches backwards. This is why this is called back stitch. So you're going to take your needle half an inch forward and poke your needle out of the fabric. Then poke your needle back down from where the last stitch ended. And this is how you go forward. You're going like a step forward and then a step back. It's a very easy stitch and I'm going to do all this design with this stitch, as I said. I want you to pay attention to which line you are stitching. If you're stitching a straight line, maybe you can do longer stitches. And if you're stitching curved lines, you should do smaller stitches, so the shape will still look round. This is why, for example, we did the clouds with um, smaller stitches. If you're new to embroidery and you're new to this stitch, maybe you should start with a basket because it has straighter lines and you can do longer stitches, which is easier. If I'm going too fast for you in this video, you can check out the video tutorial I did only for back stitch. Um, you can see stage by stage, very easy and very slowly how I do this stitch. So I have a link waiting for you in the description box. You can check it out. I want to thank my mom for helping me with this video. You see her hands stitching this project, which is also <laughs> a way to tell you. This is a very easy project to stitch. You can do it in one craft night or one weekend. And I can assure you that if you order this kit, you will definitely fall in love with embroidery. So this is it, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to check out all my videos and tutorials. And I'm going to see you in the next video. I'm going to be here every week with a new video. And you can find all my embroidery kits and patterns and some other fun stuff on my Etsy shop. Uh, the link is waiting for you in the description box. And I will see you in the next video, bye. Mm, clap. What I wanted to say... Oh! No, I'm sorry. <laughs> mm, clap. <laughs>